Good morning, Perry. The plan for today is to explore Paris. I need to get a good book. I always, this is a very interesting fact about me, every time that I travel, I always get a book from that place and bring it back and put it in my library. What else should we do today? Oh my God, how can I forget? Oh, no big deal, I'm just going to the Dior show today. Very excited about that. And uh, I think there's some fun things afterwards, but you'll have to watch to find out more. Ready to go. The first mission of the day is to get some caffeine immediately. Let's go explore Petty. Being vegan in Paris is interesting, but I am committed to finding a vegan croissant. Croissant? That was that was pretty good, right? Yeah. I feel so annoying though being an American in Paris, being like, I don't actually eat butter. I'm so sorry. Like, you don't eat butter? No. I think they're sad for me. Let's go to a wild cafe. Olé. Diamond. S'il vous plaît. I got this. We're in Paris. We're going to a cafe that supposedly has almond milk. Hopefully, because that's the line that I've been practicing with almond milk. I think I can do it. I did high school French. It was online, which is arguably not as good. Looking back, maybe I should have done it in person. Oh my god, there's so many people inside. I can't do this. Oh my god, I'm getting nervous now. Est-ce que je peux avoir un café au lait de monde? S'il vous plaît? Yes! I did it. Secure the bag. By the end of the 24 hours of Vogue, my French will be, c'est parfait. So everything is closed on Sundays and Mondays here? Fascinating. Shall we? Okay. I just found one of my favorite books in French. This book is incredible. I feel like I have to get this. It's terrible. I can't stop. It's always like this too. And I'm in the cinema section, which makes it arguably much worse for me. I feel like this book is calling my name. I'm sorry, I have to look at it. This feels like a coffee table book for my house. If this gives you any idea of what my house looks like, this is perfect. Oh my goodness, asterisk. Okay, so is this a European thing? Because I used to have one when I was a kid. I had a huge book of asterisks when I was a kid. Oh my goodness, I have to get this too. How am I gonna carry all of these books? Oh, hello, baby. Who do you belong to? I think this is my boyfriend now. Are we dating? Hello, handsome. Hi, baby. I didn't think I'd meet the love of my life this quickly in France. All right, what a beautiful man. Au revoir. I'll miss you. I'll see you in another life. It's currently 10.30 a.m. and I am finally getting my vegan croissant. Croissant, <laughs> how dare I. This is rumbling my tummy. Okay, fine, can you insist? I can die happy now. So PSA, if you haven't had your daily croissant, go do that right now. Pause this video. I asked for clean, chic, simple. I don't usually say any of those words about my makeup. I like it to be fun. But I think because the outfit is very loud and bright and fun, it's nice to kind of tailor the makeup to celebrate the outfit and let the moment be about the outfit. The beauty standards are different in every country you're in, I find. I think the French, and I correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe like the French beauty standard is very clean, simple, with like a kind of rougey pink lip, but very light and natural otherwise, right? Big brow. Yeah. America will do it all at once. Yeah. <laughs> America's like, more! 
I think as I've gotten older and more comfortable in my own skin, I've wanted to show more of my own skin. So I like a more sheer foundation. I used to love thick makeup. We all go through our phases, don't we? I'd say the worst thing I ever did to my hair, which I still feel the effects from, is I got my own thinning scissors. Mm when I was probably in ninth grade, so I would have been about 14. My poor mother really fought. She really fought for me not to do any of those things and she would take the thinning scissors away from me and I'd go find them in her room and take them back and thin my hair more. Moms know best, they truly do. They always do. They always do. Oh, it's beautiful. I love it. This is the outfit. Say parfait. No coat. I'm gonna brave the Paris cold for the outfit. Okay, let's go. <laughs> one thing, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I hate being late. Okay, goodbye. Okay, bye. Thank you. Love you You're guys. Welcome. Bye. I feel like the rabbit in Alice in Wonderland. I'm late. I'm late. Okay, we're on the way to my first ever Dior show. I'm so excited for it. I'm such a big fan of Dior. I'm very, very excited to go. I'm personally obsessed with this outfit. I don't really care what everyone else thinks about it because I like it. And that's all that matters. And that's what you should take away. It doesn't matter what everyone else thinks, it matters what you think. It's a little life lessons with Adelaide. I just got changed. Now we're gonna walk the Seine River. I've got Notre Dame behind me. I haven't even looked yet. Let me take a quick peek. It's gorgeous. Well, would you look at that? Some old Vogue Paris covers. This feels 80s to me, right? Maybe early 90s? It's so, is this like normal for Paris, having places like this? This is so cool. It's perfect. I just got this Eiffel Tower. It's beautiful. I'm gonna keep it somewhere safe and close to my heart. In my bag. I'm gonna have a vegan burger now because I haven't eaten anything since that croissant. I'm getting very cold. I would really love a tea right now, so we are on the hunt for a good cup of tea. Perhaps apricot? Hmm. Ooh, rose darjeeling, that sounds good too. really incredible. I needed a moment of relaxation. It's been a hectic day and tea is my time to relax truly. What a day we've had. It's been quite a ride. I'm really, I'm really just thinking about what we've done. If I could give Madeline 24 hours ago advice for coming to Paris for her first day. Comfortable shoes, check. Good attitude, check. Caffeine, check, but also translator, very helpful. I said at the beginning of this video that I would be fluent in French and boy was that an uphill battle that I did not win. But I do know about 10 or so phrases. Bonjour, hello, au revoir, goodbye. C'est parfait, it is perfect. C'est la vie, it is life. But I think now that I'm about to bid you adieu, is that French, adieu? Aha, she said yes. Okay, I'm about to bid you adieu. So I need to prepare something for you. Just, just give me like five or six seconds. I'm really sad to say goodbye to Vogue today. 
I've had the most beautiful 24 hours with you. And I'll never forget that. Thank you, Vogue, for having me. Okay, just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Was that beautiful or what?